Look, it's like a Chinese Hooters. Hey guys, so Sanders and I are just hey. wandering about DC. We are about to walk into um, Chinatown actually, because yeah. we're gonna go to the Urban Outfitters. Um, I love Urban Outfitters. These glasses are from Urban Outfitters. Same so. here. Well, these are K, but they sell them at Urban Outfitters. Yeah, so that's where we're off to. Yeah. <laughs> and then I think we're going to check in with some of our friends and probably go to the Smithsonian because it's open later today, surprisingly. It's a Sunday. That's kind of shocking. And it's free admission, and I've never been to the Smithsonian, so... I've been there. It's amazing. You can get your life, I swear. Oh, I'm so There's excited. There's so much things to see. Like, you would need literally a whole day to see everything. But you never, like, you, it'll take a week, really, to see everything, but you're gonna love it. Well, we're gonna try to get everything done in, like, an hour. And she got a <laughs> magnet! <laughs> right? Yes! Oh, yeah, Sanders bought me a magnet. I have to show you guys later. It's amazing. It says the first family on it, and it's, like, this really awesome portrait of, like, Obama and his family, and I die. And so. like this video if you think she should do a hundred layers of magnet challenge. I will probably end up, like, ruining some portion of my brain or something. <laughs> I have all those magnets on me, With, I don't like, know. a steel, like helmet on and it put <laughs> magnets all over Oh my over god, it. I'd start to like die. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, look, we're you just coming up on Magneto. Chinatown. Uh, Chinatown! Yes. And there's yes. Urban Outfitters. Yes. We're gonna do this, let's do it. Oh, Let's go shopping. So Sanders and I just finished shopping at Urban Outfitters and then we ran over to Bed Bath & Beyond because I had to use the bathroom because I'm a weirdo. And now we're walking to the Smithsonian because I realized it's actually not that much further than we thought. It's like three more blocks. Yeah. So we're just going to walk it. In return we get to walk by all of these awesome... Wait, what, what museum is this? Um, I have no idea. Okay, well there's a museum over here. <laughs> That's a Smithsonian but I don't know which one it is. So we are here on this map and we're gonna walk down this street to the Air and Space Museum and then also try to go to the Natural History since this is open later than this one. So, what is this outfit? Bag. Potato bag. Yeah, what is that outfit though? Like, that's not an outfit that I would ever wear, you know, nor would a regular human being. There's like this big building over there that we can't figure out what it is. Look at these buildings over here. Like, I if I lived here, I would die. Like, I would just, I, I don't know. <laughs> and you know what it is too? I'm that weirdo that watched National Treasure so many times that I'm like, I recognize these streets oh where the movie God. was filmed. <laughs> it was actually Don't... filmed here? Yeah, in DC. Hello, sir. What are you doing? See how big it is? So there's the National Archives, you guys. Very cool. Look, you guys, it's the Capitol. Oh, they're like working on it. They were working on it last year, too. And then over here is the monument. That's so cool. It's like so American right now. <laughs> Hey you guys, check out that sign. See how it says McDonald's this way? It's literally a pop-up McDonald's. Like what? I've never seen something like this in my entire life. It shows how fat Americans are. Yes, right? How many it's people do- It's easy to walk to a real McDonald's so we put it in front of us. Like a pop-up McDonald's in front of the Smithsonian. Girl. Guys, I'm losing my mind right now because I didn't realize that everything in the museum- It sounds stupid, but I didn't realize that everything in the museum would be actually things that have been outer space. <laughs> so, look at this. This was on the moon. Guys, I'm losing my mind. Look at all of these things. Look at this thing. Look at that thing. I don't even, it looks like it's just wrapped in some saran wrap, but I'm, I'm like enjoying it. Look at, this is so cool, you guys. I sound like such a basic girl. I love space. I love space. I love space. You guys, look at this like see-through clear thing. Oh, so cool. Look at these crazy planes. We're gonna go inside that plane. We have to walk inside of it. Guys, I thought that was a real person for a second. You see that? That person in the plane? That's not a real person, but it scared the crap out of me. I am an idiot. Also, look how pretty. Oh, whoa. Oh, never mind. I'm done again. I thought that, like, that streak of light on the window right here, I thought that was, like, a, one of those planes that has, like, the jet things. Oh my god. Yep, I'm just full of dumb today. Apparently, it was okay to smoke on planes way back when. This is a bathroom. Alright, oh, sorry. Looking in the cockpit sorry. here. There's a lot of buttons and stuff that I don't know about. Yeah. And for That's some reason, I, yeah, right? There's like 15 chairs in there. Like 15 places for people to sit. We're exploring the planets, you guys. <laughs> I don't know why Sanders is laughing so hard. Apparently, something was really funny that I didn't I love say. Planets. Yeah, you said that. I didn't. Yeah, because you, you ex <laughs> what are we exploring? Planets. planets. <laughs> Obviously, planets, Sanders. Come on, really? Don't put it on this guy right now. Lies, he just doesn't. He lies just doesn't. She tells. <laughs> she reads the sign. Exploring planets. What are we exploring, Sanders? <laughs> the planets. <laughs> wow. 
Wow, look at these planets. Wow. Oh, this oh is so God, cool. <laughs> What's up, Saturn? The size scale of all of these, you guys, I'm just gonna pan up so you can see. And then, and then wait, ones are the we're not even at the biggest <laughs> one yet, which is Jupiter. Like, it's crazy. Okay, well, thanks, light coming in from outside, but this is like a really cool look here. Oh, there we go. Okay, so you can kind of see it. There's like a big balloon hanging here, and it looks like um, they have, oh wait, this is a model. Okay, so they stood on the sides of it. They also have over here, it looks like the basket from one of them. See how they have the basket up there? Where you could like hang out in the basket. You know what I'm talking about? Basket? Yeah, look, the basket over there. Oh yeah! Like a basket. Like a Wizard of Oz, yeah. Wizard of Oz! Yeah, by the way, you have to tell the story. So Sanders, <laughs> so I saw the big balloon and I got real excited and then Sanders says, Oh look, the Wizard of Oz! And the kid's like, where? <laughs> and I just pointed at the balloon. That's cool. There's like, oh look at that plane with the really pointy end. Yes! Yes! Somebody with it. Right, oh, oh what, me. look, it's original planes. Yeah, I think this is the real thing, Sanders. This is oh so gosh, cool. This is it. I mean, obviously they made so many because they crashed them, but like, wow, look you guys. That's it right there. This is what started it all. This is what started. Way cool. Can you imagine how terrifying it must have oh been God. to like fly that? Because you're laying down. Look, I'm underneath it. In space, no one can hear you scream. Okay. <laughs> Even in my basement. <laughs> like, I look at something and I'm like, I can't believe this has been in outer space. Like, that has been in outer space, you guys. Like, what? How? Can you just, what is this? There we go. Check out that roaming vehicle, you guys. An instrument panel. Wow. I don't know what that means. Like, it was in the spaceship. Oh. That's what they used to fly it. I don't even know what this is, but I'm getting excited. Oh, it's an engine. Oh, wicked. So this is an F1 engine from the Saturn. Check that out. That's a, that's a massive, considering it had five engines, yeah. and this is just one of them. Girl. And how big it is, wow, I'm getting chills. Like, I'm getting, like, that's literally, like. City apartment. <laughs> Oh, there's another piece right there. I'm literally getting chills. Oh my god. Hello. See, I would say something on the Wow. Look at the tomahawk. Oh snap. Oh my god. These are these are space. Oh my god. Like, oh my god, this is These are space. Hold on. Oh, oh no, we have to go down there. Sanders, we have to go down there. Yes. We this is like my dream. Okay. <gasps> Look at the mist. <laughs> I'm losing my mind. This is this is what I live for. What is that song? Baby, this is what you came for. Lightning. Yeah. Oh look, it looks like they used to let you walk down yeah. in there and now you can't and that's yeah. upsetting. Oh man. Okay, 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 okay. <gasps> oh my gosh. I need this for my wall. I need this. Sanders, how did you walk right by these and not see that they look like boobs? Don't these look like boobs, you guys? I'm whispering to the camera, but look, they look like boobs. Are they doing like boobs? I told you. Like grandma's. DIY satellite navigation, let's do it. And there's like another one, it's like just tin foil. We can do this. So we're in this like false observatory. Is this and the observatory in LA? No, it's it. Oh, down there. It was the Mount Wilson Observatory. Oh, because I went to that one in LA when um, I was in LA. Who else is making silly statements? Not just Kaylee. I'm having moments. It's okay. We're all at our moment. We're in another room now. So this is another space room. So I'm dying, of course. There's like a space shuttle over there. Another thing from a spaceship. We're about to walk into the. This is part of the discovery. What happens to your body in space? This is how they sleep. Whoa. What? With a strange jacket on your face. That's neat. That's so cool. Let's open it up. Oh, yeah. Bye. Bye, everyone. Oh, the toilet. Everyone else. Remember, I said it was yeah. at, um, microgravity? When you sit down in microgravity, what happens? Let it go. Just float away. So, yeah, they have to trap themselves to achieve that perfect seal so that stuff doesn't come floating out. Wow. Tank, stays in this tank right here like a port potty until they get back to Earth. That's two weeks of waste from six people. Mm. So you really don't want a floating out. So as soon as you're done, get 
turn it off, the vacuum is cut off, and it just sort of shuts. Now, what do you think they do with the waste beyond that? Oh. Look at waste that you send out in space. No problem. It just freezes and then turns into a gas. However, solid waste where they. Did she just say that? What? Okay. Okay, so I know that we walked away so you didn't hear this part, but she just explained that sometimes they'll put the excrements out into space, and so urine turns to gas and it just goes away, but solid waste turns into an asteroid because it freezes on impact with space, like when it touches outside, yeah. so it becomes an asteroid. So some of the asteroids that fall on Earth, actually, yeah, could be actual poop. So you want to go run and pick them up? Yeah, like, like pick it up. You might think it's a space rock. It is a space rock, but it's not the kind of rock you want. No. Now we're on the bottom floor looking up at these missiles. Oh, why? Why are things so cool? Ooh. What? I want that to be my wallpaper. Oh my god. Best backdrop for filming ever. Oh. Although I want one of these in my house. Just like, just a giant spaceship piece. Like, that's what I want. This yeah. is so cool. Oh my gosh. You guys. I can't. Can I have this? I can has? I can has this. Yeah. That's for me. That's for me. This is the Soyuz TM-10 spacecraft. It's a landing module. Soviet manned space flight program into the new era in 1986. Huh. Oh, they wrote stuff on it. 1990? Imagine being in that little capsule between nope. the land and water. Nope. Diplomacy in space. Oh. So even though some countries might not actually get along, they get along when it comes to space exploration. That's really cool. Guys, it's Apollo 11. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. I'm in it. I'm in a picture with it. Look at it. So now this is one of the last rooms um, that we haven't really walked through yet. Ooh. Sanders is gonna touch the wheel. Touch the, the wheel, touch the wheel. No. <laughs> <laughs> I got her. We're touching I it. I love wheels. Look at this lady, she's like, I hate my life. I hate my job, just they take the good food. food back in the day. But look at her face, she's like, I hate everything and I yeah. wanna die. Low overhead, okay, thank you for the warning. We're going in. <laughs> Oh, this cockpit is much smaller than the last one that we saw. With equally as much stuff. Oh my god. Stuff. I'm claustrophobic. Oh my god. 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 I actually am claustrophobic as well, so I'm just like slowing my breathing. Oh, this is neat. Look, Sanders. Like how mm. the how the seats were set up, where like they, they face each other. I don't know what's supposed to go in there, but... Oh my god, why are we not touching it? Touch it all. What are you going to do? Oh look, here's how it was set up. Oh my god. You are here. Is this first class? I'm assuming this was first class. It's not really that classy, is it? There's like the storage. So pretty. Just imagine now. Oh, a bathroom. That's so magical. Guys, I've wanted this jacket forever, and like, <laughs> Sanders was like, it's probably like 50 bucks, just get it. I'm like, no, it's like 150. We checked the price tag, it's 150. But I've wanted it for so long, like, look, like, remove before flight. Like, oh my god, this jacket. I'm not spending $150 on it, so bye. We're on our way, we're on our way walking to the National Museum, um, what is it called? National Museum of... Natural Museum. The Museum of Natural History. And we stopped here because look at this metal tree. 